Every Sunday from now until Election Day, Ed Tibbetts, political reporter from the Quad City Times, and I are partnering to check political ads. This week, we are fact-checking an ad from the Democratic Senatorial Campaign Committee targeting Republican candidate for Senate Joni Ernst's comments on Social Security and where she's receiving funding. Joni Ernst is talking about privatizing Social Security. The ad titled Talk from the Democratic Senatorial Campaign Committee targets Joni Ernst's comments on Social Security. The ad uses a clip of Ernst. Yes, I have talked about privatizing Social Security from a chat she had with senior citizens in Des Moines. It's true, though the ad does not use Ernst's full quote, she has discussed privatizing Social Security as an option on several occasions. So first, yes, I have talked about privatizing Social Security as an option. Again, that is one solution. Uh, so what I recommend is we look at a number of solutions because we really don't know which way is the best way to go yet. I think we have to keep the promises that have been made to our seniors, but we do have to change the way we do business with our younger workers or those that are just entering the workforce. And I agree, we do have to look at some sort of a personal savings account. The ad then says, And so are the New York billionaire Koch brothers. They spent millions trying to privatize Social Security. This is true. Brothers Charles and David Koch are CEO and executive vice president of Koch Industries, one of the largest private companies in America. Americans for Prosperity Foundation, which receives funding from the Koch brothers, supports personal savings accounts for Social Security, according to a memo from the foundation. Also true. Now they're spending millions more trying to elect Joni Ernst. Freedom Partners Action Fund, a super PAC with ties to the Koch brothers, is spending $1.5 million on an ad targeting Congressman Bruce Braley through September. In June, Americans for Prosperity, a group the Koch brothers support financially, announced a new ad effort in Iowa and New Hampshire, totaling over $1 million. Their ad in Iowa again targets Congressman Bruce Braley. Finally, according to Open Secrets, Koch Industries has contributed $12,800 to Ernst's campaign, and Charles Koch has contributed $2,600. Overall, our research finds that the claims in this ad are true. The full ad, this story, and the version from the Quad City Times are on our website at WQAD.com. Just type in fact check in the search bar.